Um, what would your season 12 Jensen say to season 1 Jensen? <laughs> um. <laughs> Put a bigger engine in the Impala. <laughs> I don't know if you guys know this, but for, for the longest time we had a, a, a very small uh, a small block engine in the car, and it took me like six years of like kind of kicking and screaming to be like, can we please beef the car up? Because when people show up to set, the fans stop by the set, and I'm sitting there, and I get in the car, and it starts up, and it's like, <laughs> I'm, I'm very embarrassed. So they finally put a big block 502 in it at season seven, season six, season seven. Um, but I don't know, that's one of many things I would say in season one day. Yeah. Um, there's a meme that says, you've been killing since 05, and then I still think if we outlive Vampire Diaries, the show should end with us coming to town. Are you guys going into town? Yeah, the show's ending, isn't it? Yeah. So. I, that would, I, I would totally be game for that. Um, <laughs> we wouldn't even have to. We wouldn't even have to be there. We could just see the Impala pulling this out. I think that I think they should do that. I don't. I don't know that their that their showrunner would go for it, but I would be game. That, yeah. yeah. That, I, I love that. Right. That's a cool call. I mean, yeah, all bad. the other shows on this network are crossing over. You know, Arrow and Flash and, and every other show. Um, <laughs> We never get across. <laughs> How many are you drink? Just have the Impala go through all this. Oh, yeah. um, I usually only do one, and it's the first one up. Um, so we'll film it first, but the, it airs like two or three. And the reason we do that, the reason we pull it up and shoot out of order, is so that I can show up early, prep, get all that stuff done while not having to work, you know, as playing Dean on another episode. But doing that, it is, like, I, I do not take that. Uh, uh, that responsibility lightly. I, I bust my ass in my head and do a ton of homework, and it's exhausting after seven days of prep, eight days of filming, and then two or three days of like editing. Um, and I don't have time to like recover. I go right back into you know to filming, and so I, I kind of equate it to like running a marathon but sprinting the first three months. <laughs> So you're just exhausted. It's like there's not a lot. There's not a lot left in the tank. Um, I mean, I've done it. I can do it. But this year, I just I, I wanted to uh, I wanted to stay at home. I was also you know I also had to come back like two weeks early and start working. Um, and then he shows up two weeks after I've already been there and like like staying up sleepless nights, like you know breaking down the script. And he shows up and he's like bearded and tan. And I'm like, what have you been doing? He's like, oh man, I'm just kicking it by the pool the past two weeks. And I'm like, I want to do that. <laughs> So I did that this year. Good. Yeah. Yeah. We're also really, really thrilled to have Mary back on the show. Yes. So what do you think Dean's gonna react first? And be scared, excited? Well, I, I think there's a lot of uncertainty. Um, you know, he obviously it, it is his mom, but there's no relationship with him. She was, she died when he was like four years old. So she's essentially a stranger to him. Uh, but a stranger nonetheless that I think will Kind of lends itself to making the boys uh, vulnerable and susceptible to problems. I mean, if somebody, you know, it's another person that Dean's going to have to probably sacrifice himself for. I think you guys 